Thank you for visiting our training session from SharePointZar.com on how to create a document library within SharePoint. SharePoint is a Microsoft solution and if you would like to learn more please visit our website at SharePointZar.com. In order to create a document library within your portal you must have proper permissions. If you do not have proper permissions and cannot see the create or documents and list, you need to contact the administrator for proper rights. To create a document library, simply click on the create at the top of your website. You will notice that right out of the chute, Share Microsoft has given many documents and list ideas that you can add to your website with no special software and no programming knowledge. For the sake of this clip, we're going to create a document library. So we simply click the link that says document library. We need to give it a name. You can also add a description here. If you would like the document library to show itself on the quick launch bar, click yes. If not, click no. The quick launch bar is the left navigation bar that Microsoft sets up with each SharePoint site. To create a version each time someone edits a file within this document library, if that's what you would like, click yes. This is very important for version control. A person can go to your document library, check a file out, and check it back in and you will have the full version history. The document template, there's a drop down, but as you can see, we've chosen Microsoft Word. Simply click on Create, and there's your document library that we called, that we just created. Within this document library, you can send a link, a person can click on the alert section which will allow them to be alerted anytime you add or remove from this document library. To, to add to your document library simply click upload document and as you can see this looks very familiar it's no different than attaching a document to an email. Click the browse, find the folder on your desktop click the document, click the open, and as you can see it's here and ready to be uploaded. We will not upload the document for this exercise and therefore we're just going to click go back to document library. As you can see there are no documents there. To view access to the document library from your portal simply click on the home and as you can see, right under the quick launch, the side navigation, is the document library that we just created. If you want to share your documents, simply click on the link, go to the top of your web browser, copy and paste the link into an email, and stop attaching emails forever. Stop attaching documents to emails forever. For more training and tips on how to add to your website, visit SharePointZar.com.